Bone broth is a stock made with bones. You can make it from any bones. Beef, chicken, fish, rabbit, elk, whatever you're cooking, whatever meat you're cooking, get it on the bone and save those bones and make them into a bone broth. It's absolutely delicious. There's all different kinds of ways that you can cook your bone broth. In the pressure cooker, a slow cooker, in the oven, stove top, lid on, lid off. These are all different ways. When you cook your broth with the lid off, you get more flavor. It cooks down and cooks down. Yes, you're going to need to be adding water along the way, but really this is the best way to achieve that, that great flavor that a bone broth can give. So when you're cooking, think about each step of the way how you can pull out more flavor. Either you can roast it in the oven, or you can pan fry in the stock pot itself. Place your roasted bones in a stock pot. Cover with water by about two inches. Add a splash of apple cider vinegar. This will help pull out the minerals. Once it reaches a boil, turn it down to a low flame and let it simmer. You can let it simmer anywhere between 12 and 72 hours depending on the size of the bones. Wait till the last hour to add those aromatics to avoid getting a bitter flavor. You can create all different kinds of flavor profiles. You can add herbs, vegetables, and spices. Strain the broth and let it cool. Store in the refrigerator to help separate the fat from the stock. The fat could be discarded or used for other cooking purposes. You know when you eat something and you feel like every cell in your body is thanking you? And the taste is just incredible. It's deep, it's round, it's got the umami flavor. And the texture is sort of smooth and velvety. Traditional cultures around the planet all incorporate bone broth in their cuisine. The Japanese use a pork bone broth for their ramen. The French cook down their bone broth to a demi-glaze that give incredible flavor to their food. I think the reason why bone broth is so special is because it takes time. And I believe that when you cook something low and slow, it pulls out all the flavor. It's not only pulling out all the flavor, but it's also pulling out all the nutrients. Bone broth is incredibly nutritious. Naturally is the best thing you can do for bone health. It's high in minerals and your body absorbs and assimilates those nutrients very easily. And it also has gelatin. And gelatin is important to help the body absorb and digest proteins. And it also soothes the lining of the gut. Bone broth is one of the most nourishing foods that you can cook and give your loved ones.